All right, now in a move to enhance its user experience and cater to the ever-growing demand for real-time stock market information, finally Google has introduced a brand new finance widget associated with Google application. This is definitely quite useful and quite exciting for those of you who are into stock markets and who needs real-time stock market information. Most of us already have Google app installed on our phone, which has received a brand new update. The current version is 14.22.12.28. You will be able to use this widget only if you are on this particular latest version. Now, if you have installed the beta version of Google app, then this feature may not work. This widget may not be available. And even if it is available, it may not work on your phone. So uninstall the beta app and install the official Google app. Once you update the app to the latest version, Ocean, all you need to do is just go to the home screen, press and hold on it, tap on widgets, search for Google app here. As you can see, we have got this brand new finance watch list widget right here. Before this update, we had three different widgets. We had at a glance, search widget and sound search. Now we have got this brand new update. Just press and hold on it and bring it onto the home screen and drop it here. You can see it directly takes us to the settings where we can customize the stocks that we want to see on this particular widget. As you can see, we got featured investment and sorting options here. Let me tap on featured investments. As you can see, the stocks I'm following on Google app are available right here. I have selected the top mover here. The top mover stock will be appearing right on top of the widget. Let me just go back. Let me tap on sorting. As you can see, we can sort the watch list by name, symbol, or percentage change. And we have got ascending or descending options here. Once you save it, you can go back to the home screen. You will be able to see the widget with all the stocks that you're following. Now, this watch list will not be available by default. Obviously, you will have to customize it on the Google application. To do that, just press and hold on the widget, tap on settings. Now, here you will see edit your watch list at google.com slash finance. You can tap on this. It is going to take you to this finance page. Here you can create your own watch list. We've got different markets. As you can see, we've got US market, Europe, India. We've got currencies, crypto, futures. Depending on your region, you will get these options here. You can search for stocks, ETFs, and more. You can just tap on this plus button to create a new portfolio, or you can just search for a stock and add it to a new watch list. Pretty easy to customize. You can create your own watch list and save it on the widget. Now here on the widget, you can even scroll up and down. You can increase or decrease the size of this widget. You can fill it to the whole page as well as you can see here. And all the way down, we have got this refresh option and watch list option. If you tap on watch list, it is going to take you to the Google app where you'll get more detailed information along with the news related to those stocks. And to refresh it, you can just tap on this refresh icon right here. This widget is very informative and it is very, very useful for those of us who need real time stocks information. Now we can also stack these widgets. You can just press and hold on the widget and tap on create stack. Here I can create another finance watch list and add it to the same widget. You can just swipe across to see different stocks or different markets right here on the home screen. This is just fantastic. On the iOS, we already had this widget. As you can see, this is the stock widget on iOS. We can just set different sizes for these widgets, but this shows us limited information. Whereas on the Google's widget, we get to customize it and we can add a lot more stocks to the watch list. That is the beauty of Android. On the iOS, it is quite limited, whereas on the Android phones, it is quite customizable. This is the all new finance watch list widget from Google. Go ahead and check it out and let me know your thoughts about this widget in the comment section. And while you do that, be sure you subscribe to the channel to know your phone better. Give this video a like if you find this video informative. Thanks for watching. My name is Salian signing off. Cheers. Bye bye.